What's going on, Libras? So you have the Two of uh, Cups, Three of Wands, King of Cups, Ace of Swords, the Fool, um, the Four of Wands, Seven of Cups, the Justice, the Eight of Wands, King of Swords. I'm starting to become more familiar with these cards. So the Two of Cups, the Three of Wands, the, the King of Cups, right? Um, the Justice, which is Libra. You showed up in your own reading. Congratulations. The Three of Cups, excuse me, the Two of Cups. Mm. Mm. Okay, 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 okay. Basically, <laughs> the Two of Cups, the Three of Wands, the King of, of uh, Cups. A lot of you want to, um, a lot of you Libras are being more direct. And you're going to waste less time messing around with people who want to waste your time. The two of cups, the three of wands represents the types of relationships that you are abandoning. Not that you're not that you're abandoning relationships that deal with monogamy, right? One on one. But you're abandoning the types of relationships that appear like these people are going to do right by you, but they end up playing games. So the King of Cups is about how and you're moving and you're going about it right <laughs> because you're you're going about it very cool, calm, collected. You're not taking this disappointment out on other people. You're not doing that. You're not going to be doing that. So as a result, the Ace of Swords and the Fool, you've actually gotten to a point where a lot of you Libras have given up. And it's a it, what I mean when I say given up, I don't mean given up on actually trying to get to know other people i mean giving up on trying to go back and forth because there's different types of giving up too a lot of times people don't really understand that there's giving up in the sense where your spirit is broken and then there's giving up in the sense of you understand that trying to hold on to this particular thing you need to let go of it i.e live and let live remember it goes right back into one of my principles that i talk about about how a lot of uh, a lot of you should not be trying. No one should try to force a relationship. If it don't work, it don't work. If you're trying your hardest to get to know these people and these people are trying to do everything and they can, they never got time for you ever or the only type of time that they have for you is only when it conveniences them and they're, and you know what I mean? Then that means that you should not be hanging out with them. This is not a relationship. It's just them essentially wasting your time and them getting what they want. So the Ace of Swords and the Fool represents you Libras know this. So a lot of you Libras are not going to be wasting your time with these types of relationships. It's not that you don't want the, the monogamy. You want to be able to be one on one with somebody. But what more so you're specifically not tolerating is the nonsense that come along with it. The, the four of wands now represents this is what it is that you want. You want to be able to be with somebody where the two of you can do romantic stuff like this. Duh, Libra, right? Y'all are Libras. Y'all want that type of romantic love and it works and it's functional. The two of you actually understand each other. But unfortunately, a lot of you Libras may may be starting to think that you're that you may not have necessarily was supposed to have that. That's not necessarily true. The Seven of Cups represents you just have to you just essentially have a lot of work to do in the sense of a lot of people are out here playing games a lot. The majority are so many people are trying to compete with each other and, and climb the social hierarchy so every, so so many people are trying to climb the social hierarchy of you know i got all these options and all of these people are fa falling over at my feet waiting for me to be in a relationship with them and all this delusional stuff right so since people already think of things like this and then at the same time they come out here into the real world and they start really moving like that is obviously it makes things a little bit more difficult so the justice now represents but you libras know don't need to pay any kind of mind to those people who are more caught up with 
having a trophy wife, a trophy husband, you know what I mean? Regardless of whatever it is that you're into. I'm talking about it just in a general sense. You know, just to stunt off on other people. Because that's what it is that a lot of people are talking about. A lot of people are not talking about the institutions of, of marriage and what marriage actually means and the spirituality and the principles of marriage and stuff like this. The union of two people, the love, the appreciation, the respect, the, the, the duty, the responsibility, the hard work. People are talking about marriage and stuff like this in the sense of like money. So they've kind of taken you Libra's principles of, of Libra justice principles and they've twisted it. They've skewed it. So, so the Eight of Wands now represents you don't need to worry about this type of stuff. All of the, all, you know, people out here who are talking about this nonsense, they will most definitely get their just desserts. That this type of mentality and, and nonsense can't last forever. The Eight of Wands represents you, Libras, just have to understand this, but also continue to, to date. And if people want to want to act like they're going to skew relationships and make it disrespectful and defile it, because that's another thing, too, that people are doing. People are defiling Libra. People, Y'all, people are defiling what y'all stand for, love. They're defiling it. They're trying to make it more dysfunctional. And a lot of them are. But it's not going to work. But the King of Swords now represents, so a lot of you Libras have to learn to understand that for the people who are running game, the people who would run game, the people who would be delusional and unwise to run game on you, cut them off as soon as you get a chance and don't feel bad about it. Because now is your time, Libra. Now is your time to actually start being more direct about what you want. And if people can't give you that, then, then don't then don't pay them any attention whatsoever. It is what it is. So let's clarify some of these cards. Let's clarify the justice. You have the four swords, right? The justice, <laughs> right? You got it again. The eight of swords, the queen of cups, and then you have the ten of pentacles, right? So the four of swords, the eight of swords represents people are going to, when you, when you're more direct about who you are and what you want, people are going to try to run game on you by trying to make you give them compassion and be more compassionate towards them because they're going to want you to cut them some slack, even though they do things like they may flake on you or they may end up trying to get you arrested or they may bring you into some drama or whatever the drama is. No. Because don't give them compassion because those people know good and well what it is, but they chose to be messed up anyway. The Queen of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles represents, and they may even tell you romantic things like they love you and all of that. You Libras just need to know that all of that stuff is hogwash. They're lying. Let's clarify the King of Swords now. clarify the king of swords we have the um five of pentacles the chariot the eight of wands and then you have the empress which is also libra too because it's ruled by venus specifically libra but the uh, five to clarify the king of swords we have the five of pentacles and the chariot one of the ways in which how you get to the mandatory where you know if a person is for real or not is to ask these people questions and and check them out in time and watch their actions you know, you'll see it in real time. The uh, the Eight of Wands and the Empress represent. And if you don't see them being serious, if you don't see them really making an effort, then that's how it is that, you know, you can't trust them. 